Here's Tommy Lee. And he scored! I think you get more time on the ball when you go up levels. Right. I think when you're lower level, you don't get a lot of time because people are in your face. It's a small pitch. Something hit me and I just wanted to go pro ever since. Well, his last thing he told me is that I would go pro and obviously I've done it, but it's a shame he's not here to watch me. So this episode of the South Made Podcast was sponsored by Front to Back Development, which is currently run by Harry Salami. Um, give him a follow on the old Instagram and Twitter and Facebook and whatnot. Um, yeah, he's currently building websites for his clients at the moment, and he has kindly sponsored this episode and will be sponsoring us in the future. Thank you. What's going on, people? Welcome, welcome, welcome back to the South Made Podcast. I'm Fidel Sibu. And I'm Sam Enlove. And today we have a very special guest, Portsmouth's very own, drum roll please. Tommy Lee. Hey. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> <laughs> he, de he deserves a round of applause. Yeah. Give it up to him. <laughs> Love it, Tom. <laughs> Cheers, boys. Cheers, boys. Love. Yeah, so obviously today we've got Tommy Lee, Portsmouth's very own, like Fidel said. Um, thanks for, first and foremost, thanks for obviously jumping on. Um, you've actually had a unique story, um, so it would be great to obviously rewind back and just talk us through that journey and how you've got to the top. Well, start from the beginning, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, obviously young at Pompey, got released Ooh, Got released when I was 16, uh, obviously quit football for a bit and then went to Portchester and then uh, got signed for Baffins and then went to Bognor and after that got scouted up to Atkinson, yeah, and it's just been out there ever since. And what's it been in terms of trials and tribulations? Of course, you mentioned getting released by Pompey. Did you think to yourself, oh, you know what? I want to pack it in. I don't really want to carry on with football. What was your thought process, you know? I think at the time, uh, I think it's a young age, obviously, you know what my old man's like, mesh with football. Steve Lee, eh? Yeah, he loves the sport, <laughs> doesn't he? Let's be honest with you. But yeah. I just, I took some time off, mate, just to like think about it. And... I think something hit me inside and I was just like, Joe, what? I don't really want to go and work in, I don't know, Tesco's, go yeah. and do this. I want to be a professional footballer. Yeah. As a young young lad, that's your dream, isn't it? Yeah. So I just worked hard, met him through lockdown. I oh, went out running like non-stop. And I see you down South Sea as well, yeah. I see you a couple of times, All the time, mate. Yeah. So obviously down there working hard and then obviously it pays off, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. So when would you say was the switch then? Would you say the switch for you was when you were released from Portsmouth or obviously you said you took some time after but when was that switch like when did you think to yourself now you know what I need to take this seriously and I need to I'll know. be honest with you it's a bit it's a bit like dark but it's yeah, when, course, when yeah. my when my granddad passed away yeah yeah and uh something hit me and I just wanted to go pro ever since. of course because he he told me he told me well his last thing he told me is that I would go pro yeah and obviously I've done it but it's a shame he's not here to watch me no nah, yeah oh. No, nah, he's looking down, man, for sure. But obviously, during that time at Portsmouth, a lot changed in terms of your growth. You were pretty small, one. Yeah, I was I might have thinking at that time. 16, you know? I think I was about 5'4", something like that. And I was really small. And, and then, then obviously, as soon as I turned 18, I shot to like six foot, and now six foot three. <laughs> that's crazy. Yeah. Nah, that's mad. But yeah, no, for sure, 100%. Would you say, like, your, your granddad and your family is what keeps you going? Oh, yeah, 1,000%. Obviously, living away from family is hard, isn't it? Like... I don't know if you boys have done it, but yeah. four hours away, it's not like you yeah. can come back, like, especially with football, because you're non-stop working every day. So yeah. you have a little break, but when you do have a break, obviously you try and get home as quick as you can, but it's, it's hard to get home. Yeah, yeah. of course. And also, just a bit about your journey, because I was at Baffins with you. Well, obviously you've gone on to do big things. I'm, I'm here, do you know yeah, what I mean? But you're but fighting now, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's it. Big boy now. Big boy. We're on our own journey, but just the question I wanted to ask you, what's the difference from non-league to professional football like what are the uh, levels of standards and difference what's it like yeah. oh, I don't know it's, 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 it's obviously it's a massive difference like fitness wise uh, ability wise and all that but yeah. I think you get more time on the ball when you go up levels right I think when you're lower level you don't get a lot of time because people are in your face it's a small pitch right that's quite interesting actually and I do you think yeah, I do think when you go higher if you you, well, you look at the Prem and all that yeah and like League One, League Two and all that. And just, just everything's just like, you get more time on the ball. That's what it looks like on TV anyway. Yeah. And I've got to admit, I do think it is true. Like yeah. You get more time on the ball. A lot of people have said it and I, I agree with it. Yeah. And obviously you've been back at Fratton Park and you've played at Fratton Park as well. Yeah, cheers for that one. Which, so don't mention that one. No, 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 but you played <laughs> there. Nine minutes, yeah. yeah. No, 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 but you've played, you've played there. Do you know yeah. what I mean? So it was... It? Yeah, what, it, was un it was unbelievable, mate. Yeah. I'll be honest with you. Like walking out that dugout, I don't know, I don't know how many. I think it was like seventeen thousand or something. Like that. It yeah. was it was good to see, and obviously, 
didn't have the best of starts. You know what I mean? I've done nine minutes and then I've done my shoulder. And so, yeah. and this is an inspiration. Like personally, if you're around 16 and you're thinking, oh, it's a bit too late. Like, cause those are the words that I said, you know, when you're yeah. obviously trying to make it as a footballer, you're thinking 16, I'm a bit too old to make it. And when you see stories like yourselves, you're like, you're thinking like, I'm inspired, you know what I mean? Because you, you hardly get to see these stories and straight from what step is, is Bogna? Step? step two, isn't it? I think. Step, step two, yeah. Is it step three? Step, 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 step three, yeah. Step three, yeah. Step, I was step, close, I'm on the way. <laughs> <laughs> no, but from step three all the way to, all... to League One, that's 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 such a, a big jump. It is, such an yeah, it is a massive to, jump to people for sure. I just don't think at a young age, if you get released one clubs, like coming from me, just never give up. Yeah. No. I'll be honest with you, if you give up, it's, you know what you're going to do, you're going to work somewhere. And as as a young lad, I never give up, mate. And yeah. and, you're and you're done, you're done, do you know what I mean? And I, I, well, I've done all right, and obviously I want to progress. No, you know for I mean? sure. I don't want to stop. I want to keep going and go uh, going as high as I can. Do you know what I mean? And your mentality, what was your your mentality like going from like obviously Bogner to Accrington? Were you like, did you feel like you were an imposter? Was it imposter syndrome, or were you were like, I'm made for this? No, do you know what? I think like I think you build yourself up for it, and obviously. As soon as I turned up the training mat, I was like, nah, better than everyone there. Really? Like, guarantee, yeah, like, I was, you know, yeah, I was, I was yeah. like, yeah. Yeah. Young, a young age, obviously, like, I might come across cocky. No, nah, it's not. Like, I might come across, that, but you've got to have that in you. You've got to have that bit of fight in you, that desire to go and... 100%. Go and do, show show what you're made of. Like, obviously, I didn't really get the gig. Like, yeah. I didn't really start, didn't really play a lot. And then I showed myself in, like, cup games and all that. When I did get the start, I scored a goal, quite a couple of goals. Mm. And then the gaffer gave me a chance and... Played against Plymouth for my first game. I scored, but we lost 4 1. But I still got I still got That's the goal. It don't obviously it means a lot to me scoring the first goal against Plymouth. Like, That's it. It's big. It is big, but because even wait, sorry, just uh, I just had a quick thought. I remember at one point you you played against Everton. I was thinking you're playing against James Rodriguez. <laughs> yeah, no, that <laughs> one that, that one was a bit mad to be fair. Obviously, that was like my first time playing really for Atkinson and playing against them, it was just like it was mad, mate. I'll be honest with you. Wasn't yeah. it? The levels. Yeah. That he was unbelievable, mate. Like, <laughs> he didn't even try. Like, yeah. he didn't even try. Like. It must be just like the technique, everything. Yeah. Just like first touch. Mate, he didn't, I promise you now, he didn't even break a sweat. Really? Yeah, yeah, I promise you. Like, he was just incredible. Everything he'd done, like, he just scans, mate. And if, you, if you're behind him, he'll find a space somewhere, mate. Like, it's guaranteed. It's just levels to it, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Also, just a quick question I just wanted to ask. How much of an influence is your your dad in all of this, you know? Because I know he coached you at Baffins, do you yeah, know yeah. what I mean? So, of course, and I know, do you know what I mean? He's coached me as well. I yeah. know what he's like. So, he's, you uh, as his son, you know what I mean? He's been hard on me. Yeah. Uh, in a good way. I thank you, no. I thank him. Like, he's he's done a lot for me. Like, taking me to, like, a way to like when I played against Tottenham, like as a young age, yeah. like for Pompey, yeah. going away trips like that, mate. And it, obviously, it cost money to go there. Of course, and my old man's took out of his time to take me up there on a, a, a Sunday morning when yeah. he's hanging. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So, of course, he took a lot of time, but he was he was the one who told me, like, a lot of times he'd tell me I would go pro, and yeah. I doubt myself sometimes. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, at a young age, like you do, as soon as you get released, you doubt yourself a couple of times. But he was the one who turned around to me and said, "Come on, like." Sort yourself out, yeah. what you're doing. Do you know what I mean? And he was the driver, really. Yeah, like, yeah. One minute, well, you know how he is on oh, a football pitch, man. On the sideline, that's abusing yeah. people. You do a good pass over the top, and he'll shout at you. Do you know what I mean? I can imagine being a son. Mate, oh, don't. <laughs> it's not, it's and, not too bad, but it's yeah. all right. And even you, you obviously played with your brother as well. I think at Bogner, at Bogner, Bogner well. uh, Baffs and, and Bogner, Bogner well, and Porchy yeah. and Moneyfields. Oh, I've played with him all along the way. I'm not a set Aki. Yeah. So I haven't played him at. He needs to make a step out. He's done his ACL. Oh, oh, is he? Yeah, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, he's getting surgery. Yeah, he's getting but surgery. What's, 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 what's that like? Obviously, playing, having coming from a footballing family. I, I know you've obviously just mentioned about your dad, but having a brother as well, which which plays. I think I'll be honest with you, mate. I, I think Ashton actually was better than me at one time. Like, yeah, he was. A player I think he was. He was a player. You know, he is in your yeah, areas, mate. He was a good player when yeah. he and obviously playing with him. Uh, he sort of played the wing, then he sort of all like centre half, and obviously I was CDM at the time back 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 then anyway, and. Uh, I just thought he was, I thought he was a player, mate. Like, no joke. Nah, he's could, a very I think, player. I think if he had, if I had his ability, yeah. Or like, yeah, I think if I had his ability, but I had my heart, I don't know. Mate. Yeah, no, I'll just think. His left foot, I just remember it. <laughs> yeah. That's mad. He's got a crazy left foot. His left foot is crazy. He's a good left foot. Yeah. But, um, but you've obviously dwelled on, on the fact that you want to keep getting to the top. That's every boy's dream, yeah. obviously, getting to the top. So just wanted to understand what's. What's the future for you? What where do you want to see yourself eventually playing? As hard as I can, mate. I can't. 
I can't really say where I want to go. Of course, yeah. I just want to say. You like, just want to aim. I just want to aim where as high yeah. as I can, mate. And I don't, I don't want to give up, mate. I want to no, go sure. until my career is ended, really. Sometimes you, know I mean? you sit back and be like, I've already made, like, I've. No, done you my can't. Stuff, I don't think you could do that at this age, mate. I'm only 23. Yeah. I think at a young yeah. age, mate, you got to expire yourself, just go as high as you can. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Also, I just wanted to ask you about the lifestyle difference, you know, because yeah. obviously you have like fans cheering you now. Do you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> it's crazy, bro. Yeah, it's, not, it's not normal. To I, bumped be fair, into, I bumped into your mum at Tesco, and she was saying, mate. Like we, they went up to watch you at Akron, and yeah, apparently yeah, there was yeah. like fans in the street cheering yeah, your name. Yeah, it's you not. Know? Nah, mate, I'll tell you the story. Yeah. That's so this, no, this, this is a funny. Like a this is a funny. Himself, it's crazy. crazy. <laughs> what? what? Said for now, like a fan himself is getting crazy. <laughs> 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 Are you getting <laughs> crazy? <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm a fan. I thought no, it was a flow on me. I was about to say, what's on me? Guy got jokes now, yeah. Sorry, sorry to break you off, but yeah, listen. What's it like? I'll tell you the story. Yeah, this this one story. So, my mum and dad come up. I don't know what game it was, but they come up for a game and. um we went went for food after, mm. and I, I didn't go far away from Axton. I just went around the corner to be fair, because it was only a little bit of grub, and then we got to shoot back up. And um, so he was in the pub, sat down, and all this, and the fans walk in, like start shouting my name and all that, and I was just like, ah, oh, like it's not real. Do you know what I mean? It's nuts. Yeah, that, <laughs> and uh, I remember getting up. And walking off and then shout, <laughs> shouting my name. And my old man turned around and started clapping. <laughs> that's crazy, though. <laughs> he was loving it, oh, mate. I Honestly, love he was mate, loving it. No, well, he was that's loving it. That's it's, what it's, it's, made it's, of, it's, it's nice. It's nice to see, mate. I've got, I've got him it. Like, yeah. Obviously, I never used to have it at Bath Sleep. What did you get? About 25 fans? Yeah. But, <laughs> mate, it just must be crazy though, as parents <clears throat> to see your son, you know what I mean, no, grow up. Sure. Now they, yeah, they, they say they're proud. Yeah. And obviously, I believe them. Of course. But uh, I think it's just a different lifestyle, mate. Like, you can... You can't do what you want. Oh, really? Do you know what I mean? You can't go out, can't really go out doing like clubbing. You can't no. go out, go and do what you want because you got to like. You got to be all in. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Them. So you sacrifice a lot, mate. Yeah. Like, people go away on holidays like all the time, like IB for and all that. And obviously, I've had six weeks off, mate. I haven't been on one holiday. Yeah, but you're it's not. You're not off. Yeah, you've no, just no, done no, a no, session with us, you know. Yeah. So you've yeah. just done a one-to-one -one with um, BS Performance, shout BS Performance. Yeah. So yeah, yeah that's what I'm saying. So, mate. You're putting in, you're putting oh, in the work. To. It's gonna pay off for him. And it's paying off. Hopefully, 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 hopefully. You know hopefully. what I mean? Yeah. But yeah, still no. got next season out. Yeah, big yeah. one there, big but, one. But what, what are the goals for next season then? Yeah. Target wise, how many goals? <laughs> how many goals? Obviously, you got for? relegated. Yeah. Obviously, yeah. Down to League Two, scored twelve last season. Well, aiming for twenty. Mate, that's, yeah. a, that's a very good return, especially yeah, as in, 20 you're in the middle of the park, aren't you? Yeah, yeah, but it's central attacking there, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. But bits. I'm aiming for twenty, mate. I scored. Obviously, last year I was playing up top for a bit. Yeah. So obviously, I won't play in midfield. So. And how was that? Oh, you tell me. You know, <laughs> I don't even want to mention about that. Really? When you're coming out against geezers who's like six foot eight, mate, and I'm there like six foot three, I'm thinking I'm tall. Yeah. Like, yeah I, I thing, think like, I am tall, six foot three. Physical, it's not small, it? is it? But physical. Them lot, like when you turn around, mate, and you're like, <laughs> God, bloody eyes. That's that's you know what I mean? No, for sure. Like, 100. What's the like the physical element like in? in professional football as well yeah. if it's you, a lot of gym work mate, is it yeah eating the right food a lot of gym work it's more like uh, cardio is it yeah it's more cardio work but you know as you, you're in the gym every time yeah, hey, <laughs> Joker. But nah, nah, nah. <laughs> that's for us boys not real <laughs> hey for me look at me make sure you cut that <laughs> I'm even skinnier than him <laughs> see me in the gym mate yeah I know then 5, five kgs in one hour going that isn't he he's a joker you're, you're there with 20 he's like comedian. <laughs> <laughs> no but I always feel like league 1 championship and league 2 as well is like quite demanding because you're playing Tuesday playing Saturdays like, you know, the Prem is just obviously yeah you obviously do get, stuff, you get your recovery don't you yeah like, you get your ice baths what I hate, I'll be yeah. honest with you, I can't stand it. Like, I love the sun. But, yeah. <laughs> but it must yeah. be like high maintenance though, because you know you've got someone looking after your nutrition, looking after your strength and conditioning. Like, do you know what I mean? You've got people backing you now. Yeah, yeah, and they're 100%. backing from a yeah, professional yeah. club, you know. You don't have to do it. Okay. So I think some clubs, they'll be quite like relaxed on you. Right. About like, because obviously if you play 90 minutes, yeah. you come in the next day. Hmm. I'm not being funny, mate. Your legs are gonna, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Guarantee, because I'm not being funny. Obviously, you get your GPS, and um, you obviously it tracks how much you run, like, you, like how fast you go, and all that. Yeah. And you do, you do near 10k every game. That's what like that's a guaranteed yeah, that's thing. Crazy. Do you know what I mean? With most, oh. that's even with centre halves. Fucking hell. And you, you don't think centre halves move that like, yeah. a lot, but like they do. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So really, you're doing like 10k a game, and then the next day you come in, you're doing your recovery. Obviously, you get in the ice bath. Yeah. You get on the bike. You get the rollers on your legs. 
Yeah. And obviously, I'll sit in the corner and just watch. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm intrigued, though, because obviously, when I was playing with you, you was always like top yeah. two, top one fittest player in the team. So how, do you, how does that compare now that you're actually in a professional environment? Do you know what, mate? I'll, I'll be honest with you, mate. Like, out there, mate, I've been the fittest. Really? Yeah, mate. I know I'm not I'm surprised. I was, surpri I was very yeah. surprised. You think so? Because obviously, think, I've yeah. jumped, like, what was it, three or four leagues? Oh, yeah. yeah. And obviously, I'm going out there, I think, like, I've got to get myself mega fit here. And I turned out and I was like, oh, some of these boys ain't fit, you know? Really, yeah. But you, you just got to back yourself, no, think, you know, like, do you know what I mean? As a young, young lad, you're coming into a, a tough, tough team. Mm. And you just got to back yourself. I think that goes back to, goes out to anyone. And that's like, one got thing back I'll yourself, say. Mate. You and far, Ashton right? have always sort of bit, had that um, confidence. About it's it, confidence. You know? yeah. It's not. It's sometimes it's a little bit cocky, but, but no, it's not. not I don't think it's, it's different uh, to arrogance. It's different to arrogance. Yeah, I feel like, like you have to have confidence. To, yeah. to, one to million get to percent. Was to get where was to get wherever you want. You got to have confidence for sure. But I know you obviously rushed into Atkinson, so. Yeah. We've got a last little bit of uh, quick fires for you, mate. Sit so let me grab the, grab the phone. Oh, I can't ready. wait for quick this. Quick fire questions, mate. Come on. Come on, then. You've got to get it in, bro. What are these, then? What are these? Grab it. Can't wait for these. Going on to my camera. What's your favourite food, man? <laughs> <laughs> Every day. Okay. So you're well. <laughs> so you ready? First one. Got to be quick. Mate, hurry up, mate. No, I'll try. <laughs> Win the Prem or play in the Champions League? Hopefully soon. <laughs> no, well, out of the one. You have to oh, I thought you said, where, would you, I thought you said, when, no, where no, are you no, going to play? Bro. Win the Start Prem. Against, would, like, would, you like to, would you like to win the Prem? <laughs> Oh, rewind, 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 rewind. Did you hear what I he said? Was that me? Oh, Sam, do you want me to read that? I don't know how it was. I don't know how it was. That was quality read. I'm sorry, we're going around. He's bumping what, what would you like to do? <laughs> win the Prem or play in the Champions League? Win the Prem. Oh, okay, good. Get one bit. What? Really? Wait, no, wait, no, wait, no. Let's rewind. Wait. You'd rather win the Prem than win the Champions League? Yes, I'd be in the Prem. Wait. Yeah. Okay, fair yeah, enough. Yeah, 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 <laughs> you'll you'll yeah, be in the prem. prem. Nah. No, but you'll be you'll Win be somewhat. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. it depends where you are in the prem. You reckon? Come on, mate. Champions League, quick, go quick the fire. No, I'll, mate, go, wait, wait, I'll, I'll go prem. Yeah, get one. What? Well, earn one billion a year for the rest of your career, or win the World Cup. Win the World Cup. Yeah, nah, that's a good one. I'll Best player you've played against? With England. Uh, England. Barry Bannon. With England, who else? Really? Friends there. Oh, uh, very good player. Oh, oh yeah, yeah nah, he's a good player. Nippy. Yeah. Nippy. Yeah, he's he's unbelievable. unbelievable. Oh, mate. Unbelievable. Best Point. player you've played with. Can't be obviously me. It's definitely not you. It's definitely not you. can't pick me, obviously. I'd go Joe Pritchard. Actually, no, no. Can I change that? Actually, go Colby Bishop. Colby Bishop. Colby Bishop, very good. Where's he played? Pompey. Pompey now, isn't it? Up top. Oh, you used to play with him at Aki. You used to play with him at Aki, yeah. He's the one who got me my goals. Yeah, player. Favourite footballing moment to date? Playing against Leeds in the FA Cup. Oh. Yeah. Big achievement in that. Prem team, isn't it? Yeah. Playing against the Prem set them. Yeah. Especially in the FA Cup, cup mate. Yeah. Scoring the quality, penalty in the third round. Yeah. That's pretty crazy, oh, yeah, though. Yeah, the that feeling. Was, yeah, that was crazy. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. That was yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. Favourite, favourite musician or musical artist? DBE. Your go to initiation song. Ooh, wow. Mario, Mario, let me love you. Nah, is it? it's uh, Little Things by One Direction. No, man, oh, cut. Go right there. <laughs> 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 you've got to sing it. You've got to sing it. You've got to sing it. I've got to sing it. I'll sing it. I'll sing it. I'm confident to sing that. Sing it. He's confident. Oh, he's got it. Nah, I'm right. What it? Okay, last friend. Favorite film? Home Alone, Lost in New York. Oh, nah, so it's a good choice. Like solid, that. a solid, good, yeah, yeah, solid. Big one, big footballing question here: Messi or Ronaldo? Ronaldo. Oh, easy, quick. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah, quick. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So rapid, then, but he's wrong. He's wrong. <laughs> wow, <laughs> he's wrong. Well, wow, yeah. Wow, yeah. So what, just, yeah. just stick to your fighting. <laughs> it, it does, he's a footballer. Oh, yeah. no. But um, last one that I've been thinking about, obviously, since Pep won the Premier League and uh, what the treble, Pep or Alex Ferguson? Pep. Ooh. Quick, now nah, I think that's a good choice, though. Quick, yeah, really? I think it's tight. Yeah. It's tight, yeah. but Pep. Yeah. It's tight. Yeah. It's the same as Ronaldo. Messi is Ronaldo. Yeah, nah, you're right. You're right. You're right. <laughs> Says you're right. Says you're right. But you, you couldn't. Nah, I'm joking. <laughs> he's wrong. He's wrong. He's wrong. He's wrong. <laughs> but now nah, that's it for the quick fight. You did pretty well. That was good. That was good. And yeah. But anyway, that does draw a close to this episode of South Made. Um, thank you for tuning in once again, Tommy. It's been a pleasure. Top, man. My guy. Thank you for the Top, time. Man. Top lad.
lads. Appreciate hey. that. Hey, that's a wrap. Thank you very much. As always, subscribe. Shut up, Sam. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's finished me. Shut up, Sam. Subscribe. Shut up, Sam.